Hey, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, I like to post videos about stewardship and stewarding our lives before God. This can work itself out very differently in our lives, um, just in how we utilize our time, our resources, and our health. So over the past year, I've been slowly minimizing my possessions and just keeping the things that I value and use intentionally. And I wouldn't call myself a minimalist by any means, but rather just looking at the things that I have and really just living with intentionality in what those things are. To me, this feels like good stewardship of the things that God has given us. With minimizing, I've begun to see what I actually use and don't use. And a lot of the things that are around my house, I really don't use half the time. So this brings me to my clothes. I don't actually own a lot of clothing to begin with, but when I look at the clothes that I do have, a lot of them are items that I've said, oh, I might wear that one time, or um, that might be good for this time in my life, and then they end up just sitting there, and I really don't ever wear them. So it's time to declutter and minimize my closet. So this is my closet beforehand, and I don't feel like I have a ton of clothes to begin with. Um, but there's definitely some things in here that I no longer wear that I just want to um, kind of minimize everything in here. So. It didn't look like a lot hanging up in my closet, but now when I actually like lay everything out on my bed, it just seems like there's so much here, which makes me want to get rid of things even more. I think it also looks like a lot because this is also all of my clothes. This is my workout gear, my winter clothes, my summer clothes, so all of it is right here. I'm gonna make my way through all this stuff and then I'll show you exactly what I'm gonna keep and what I'm gonna get rid of and why I'm gonna get rid of some of the things. A few questions that I ask myself when I'm decluttering and going through my clothes is just how often do I wear them? Um, is this a piece that I like to wear? Do I like what I look like in it? Um, and also, is it just comfortable? You know, I feel like I have so many clothes that I say I'm going to wear at some point and then a year later I go and I look and it's still there <laughs> and I have not worn it. Um, mainly because, you know, it's not comfortable or um, it doesn't fit right. So those are the kind of items that I probably want to declutter from my closet. Do you ever like start going through your clothes and realize that you probably have something in every single color? Because I'm going through my cardigans right now and I feel like I have every single color. <laughs> So uh, I definitely need to get rid of a few of those since I'm not wearing them. This is a whole lot of organized chaos right here, but we're making some progress. I have this one shirt from Old Navy that I literally have in three different colors here. I feel like I never wear them. I don't know if it's just because it's so warm here all the time, so I'm not wearing long sleeve shirts often, but um, I also don't know if I like the cut on me. I'm going to try it on and just see what it looks like again and see if maybe I want to keep like one of the colors. Okay, so after I tried them on, I did actually really like them, which makes it harder, I think, sometimes when you try clothes on because then you're like, oh, it looks so cute. But um, I think what I'll do is just like keep one color of it, maybe. Um, I'm thinking either the pink or the blue one. So I have a whole other pile here of stuff that like I'm considering getting rid of, but I wanted to try on first. And now it makes me a little nervous to do that. But anyway, I don't need them all. There's way too much here. So I'm gonna go ahead and try these on and then decide what I'm gonna get rid of. Just a few things that I am getting rid of. Um, white jeans, I love these, these are J. Crew, but um, white jeans and kids are just not a good idea. I'm gonna donate them. Um, I would sell them, however, there is some staining on it that I just don't feel like would be good for selling. A lot of this stuff I am gonna sell. If you don't know, um, I don't think I've talked about it on this channel much, I do reselling part-time um, on Poshmark and eBay. So I actually sell a lot of things on there and um, most of this stuff I'm gonna just post on Poshmark. That's where this will be. And it's just a really good way to get rid of your clothes as well. Instead of just donating, especially right now with COVID, everyone is donating to Goodwill and I feel like they're just overwhelmed with stuff. So. Um, trying to sell your stuff, especially with the holidays coming around. A few other things I have that um, I really, you know, was debating on. I've had these pants for a while. They're like a 
more of a formal pants, but they're still, um, I don't know, I feel like they're kind of casual to wear to church. They're really nice and they're linen, but um, they're a petite, so I am not petite by any means. I'm f about 5'6", so uh, I think I've tried to wear them a few times and they're just a little short, so unfortunately I'm going to try and sell these. Then I do have two pairs of active leggings. Um, I actually bought these on Poshmark and um, I do like them, they're Reebok, but I for some reason just don't like printed leggings. Like I like just plain black or um, gray color. Um, so I'm probably going to put these back up on Poshmark and then these are full length leggings and then also I have these like, um, I don't know what print you would call that, like a floral that are cropped leggings that I just don't reach for anymore when I wear, when I go to work out. So, I'm going to get rid of those as well. I have right now three pairs of jeans, one of which I'm wearing, and then another pair that I just got. Um, and then I have these uh, pair of jeans that were like my go-to for the longest time. And then I recently got these new, these two new pairs of jeans. Not new, they're thrifted. I will say that 95% of my closet is thrifted already. So um, I just got two pairs of thrifted jeans. So I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of these jeans. I got rid of about one, two, three cardigans. <laughs> I was saying I have like every single color cardigan, so I'm gonna get rid of those. Um, I have two tank tops here that are really cute. They're just kind of, they feel a little young, or uh, I don't know what the word, adolescent, I guess. Um, I really like them, but I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of them just as I'm in my 30s now. Then there's just a few other things like these yoga pants that I've had since I was in high school probably. I have a maxi skirt which I don't really often wear skirts. If I wear something dressier I usually wear a dress not a skirt. And then just a few tank tops that I've had for like the longest time that I just don't wear anymore. Um, I have clothes in here probably from when I was in high school so it's just time to get rid of them. I have this North Face um, quarter zip which is really nice. It's like a fleece cream color. Um, the only problem is, is I always feel like it's a little bit too small. So that's just one of those items, like I was saying, that, you know, if it doesn't fit right or you don't feel comfortable in it, you're probably not going to wear it. So it's just better to go ahead and get rid of it. So we're going to declutter that. And then also this really cool Adidas jacket, um, which I really like. And I feel like every time Brad sees it, he's like, why don't you wear that? But I just don't end up wearing it. You know, I don't reach for it. So um, I have other jackets I can wear for working out. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that one too. I also have a bunch of just plain, um, like casual t-shirts. Um, I have three of them here that uh, I really like. I do have a bunch of just plain t-shirts that I kept. Um, but these ones have stains on them. I just... It's like inevitable to not get stains on t-shirts and and then I forget when I put them in the laundry basket that there were stains on them and I don't put stain spray on them and then they're ruined. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of those. Okay, so it's a little bit more condensed now. This is pretty much all of what I'm keeping. Um, this is like my workout gear. I have my sweatpants, my like jeans, leggings, and just some like graphic tees. Um, I feel like these are a lot harder to get rid of because they're a lot more sentimental. Um, so I do have some of those. All of this is going to be put away. It's mainly summer clothes. Um, and then I do still have a lot of like formal wear and dresses and stuff that I might declutter, you know, at a later time. But right now, just being in the military, um, we still need some formal stuff. So, um, that's all the stuff I'm keeping. And then down here is the stuff that I'm going to get rid of. Okay, so this is the final declutter. It looks so good. There's so much more room for activities. <laughs> but this is pretty much my main clothes right there. And then some sweatshirts and my socks and underwear. Is that good? So yeah, much better. So that's it guys, thanks so much for watching and hopefully this just kind of inspires you to maybe do a little bit of your own decluttering in your home and just think intentionally about the items that you actually have or use. I'll catch you next time.